Next year, a change is coming in the way we handle food waste in the Metro Vancouver region. So the change in 2015 is that we're going to have to separate our organics and our kitchen scraps from our normal garbage. Just as we've done recycling for decades now, so we're going to have to do the same thing with organics. Now, the Metro Vancouver Regional District is expanding this shift in waste disposal to include businesses, schools, and public facilities across our region. Everyone's affected by this ban, whether you're at home, at work, or out in the community. We need to think differently. We need to think about how do we separate our organics, our recycling, and our solid waste. The new waste disposal rules are being introduced by Metro Vancouver after consultation with local governments and businesses throughout the region some of which have already made the switch. Most single-family homes in this region already have organics pickups. We know that restaurants and businesses and some schools have already embraced this change. And we look upon those leaders to help others as we bring forward this change into Metro Vancouver. The new rules for food scraps will come into effect in the new year. However, Metro Vancouver is hoping to facilitate a smooth transition by giving waste haulers and their customers time to adjust to the new rules. Well, although the ban comes in on January 1st, 2015, there will be a six month window that we will work with the haulers to identify the organics material that's in their garbage. After the six month grace period, enforcement will be phased in to ensure compliance. Changing the way we handle waste has long-term benefits for our region. It reduces our dependence on landfills, cuts down on greenhouse gas emissions, and creates new opportunities to repurpose organic materials. Separating out our food waste from our garbage makes sense from so many different perspectives. It allows us to take out that good quality material and create compost with it, or put it into a bioenergy facility so that we can fuel engines. It's something that we should do to protect our environment now and into the future. For more information on the new food waste rules and helpful tips for implementing waste separation strategies, please visit the Metro Vancouver website at metrovancouver.org backslash food scraps.